Dude, doesn't that rip? You're an idiot. No, you're an idiot. Hola. Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. Well, I was going to say compadres. Is compadres it? Yeah. Oh, man. Is compadres. He couldn't even co- put a, a modicum of thought into is his opening line. Is compadres right? I, I, I don't know what you're trying to Chris, say, but that is It was a like, word. hola, friends. Yeah, hola. Amigos. Hola, compadres. It's amigos. Well, yeah. compadres could compadres be, Compadres is like compatriots. It's, yeah. your, it's your ally. It's uh, friends, for sure. Amigos is uh, friends. Right. Hola, compadres. We're not, don't edit that, James. I, I want everyone know. to know We're how it is here. That. This is uh, what I have to work with. Welcome back to the You're <laughs> podcast. I'm Alex with some guy named Jeff. Bilingual Asmus. Alex Dragovic. And uh, we have a very special guest today, the hilarious Chris. Higgins. Christopher. Yeah, and I'm fucking wearing sunglasses. Yeah. The elite level comic. One of the best around. One of my best friends ever. And, and, and he's Jeff something. <laughs> and the guy that hugs Jeff when he doesn't want to be hugged. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I like Chris hug me. The guy Chris that hugs hug Jeff me. and he has never hugged me back once. That, yeah. uh, <laughs> stiff, stiff arms on either side. He goes planked. That is very true. Uh, I'm going to take the glasses off now. It was a bit. It wasn't good. <laughs> That's fair. I, I do not hug well. That's true. No, I mean, it's okay. <laughs> I, I like being hugged, but I don't hug back very often. Mm. Yeah. Huh. So maybe that's some, is that something to unpack? Yeah, it's something to unpack, maybe. Selfish maybe. lover. <laughs> Selfish. Right <there>. yeah. Oh. <laughs> told that I like to get hugged, but I won't hug him back, baby. <laughs> yeah. I like to come, but I don't make him come back. I'm about to say, <laughs> I, 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 never, I never thought about it. Maybe you lasting 12 seconds in bed was selfish after all. Oh, it absolutely is. Yeah, I mean, that's oh, no yeah. doubt. it's no doubt. It's, it, it's it, a mental block. It never wasn't selfish. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a mental block. Tucker Brookshire said he had it, too. He has to go to sex therapy. Wait, wait, he has a, for his... He, he, this is a long time ago, years ago. We're just ago, dropping names years, like yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, I maybe bleep that out. <laughs> We're just airing out ex-roommates' dirty laundry? <laughs> it's not dirty. <laughs> it's cool to come quick. It's cool. See, on this pod, it's cool to come yeah, quick. Oh. Yeah, fucking yeah, good is so, not so well, Yeah, here. welcome to uh, a different universe, man. <laughs> Hell yeah. Welcome to the <laughs> Thunderdome. Incels don't please women. <laughs> yeah. That's not our we goal. We come whenever we want and oh, we're here. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> the, you didn't know what you agreed to. Uh, I, like, begged to be on the podcast. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we all, it was yeah. a mistake. <laughs> we yeah, have we, to mention cum every five minutes. We also think, yeah, we think going down on women is optional, too. Oh. JK. Oh. JK. JK. Rowling, our uh, hero. I do not support that message. I'd go down on JK. (laughs) I'm down there too much. Simmons. (laughs) She's like, come on back up now. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, yeah, you got the beard. Yeah, you got to be that way. That's good. Yeah, whatever. You were built for it. Mm -hmm. The man was built to eat pussy. (laughs) Oh, yeah. (laughs) It probably sticks. It's probably all over your beard. Jesus. Dude, good. That's why I never wash it. No, I do. (laughs) That's so gross. I definitely do. But you can never really wash it all. I it's mean, a thick beard. There's yeah. beard shampoo. You have special beard shampoo? Yeah, yeah. I bought huh. it from an, a, 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 an apothecary. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's how much apothecary. pussy Chris eats. <laughs> yeah. I, 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 I got to shampoo he's, this thing. He's like, this. I got I to gotta see a specialist. Gotta, yeah, I got to go to an apothecary and special <laughs> shampoo. <laughs> that's, that's, that's good. Uh, this is good. I, that's good. This is good. I relate to that. This is good. I relate I, to I, yeah, eating out women for hours. I, <laughs> yeah, that's I me. too. Me too. Hours, me too. not hours. The Jeez. hound. They call me the hound. They do not call you the hound. <laughs> the hound with a give me a give the hound a glass of water and he'll drink it. Christopher <laughs> Higgins. You could just make up. Things. What have you been up to, man? What's been going on? You're his How roommate. Your... Yeah, you were there. No, actually, I was in New York. He's been gone for ten oh, days. For true. ten days. I haven't seen you in ten days, dude. Yeah, it stunk. These two have lived together for how long? Five years, right? Yeah. Four years? Yeah, five years. Four or five. I can't really. Recall. I don't know either, actually. You've lived together for four or five years. Yeah, I think ish. it's five now. It's count, coming up on five. Count We're coming of up three, on five. On the count of three at the same time, say the other person's worst quality as no, a roommate. No, no, <laughs> no, no, no. We're not doing oh, this. Oh, come on. We're not doing this. Goes to bed too early. That, oh. also, that is true. <laughs> that is true. I actually go to bed Does pretty Drago early. Drago fuck loudly? Uh, no, mm, you guys you, probably never hear each other. You're on no. different floors. We're like a, but yeah, we don't share a wall. We share like a floor, and I don't know if it's coming 
up the floor. The and only thing, the only, the only like noise I hear from Chris' room is when, uh, is when Liverpool scores. <laughs> 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 uh, I'm like, so I, I guess technically I could hear him having sex more, but yeah. it's mostly. I'm, li- never, I'm <laughs> never as violently happy <laughs> the, the, during the, sex. The as big, I am. the big pops are during a Liverpool goal. <laughs> <laughs> Sadio Mane buries one. Yeah. I'm coming the, everywhere. Yes. <laughs> oh my God! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking go! Dude, fuck you, Man City! <laughs> yeah, 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 Aren't yeah. they good? Are they good? <clears throat> Liverpool's good? Yeah. Liverpool's great. Yeah, they're very good. Okay. Yeah. I don't know much about it. It's been, yeah. it's been a good year. But yeah, do we even roommates? And we've actually seen a lot of roommates come and go. Yeah, it's been you and I for like five years. Holding down the Are you the only originals left? I guess, I mean, yeah. Yeah, from that, from from the when Drago moved in, it was like my brother and a, and a bunch of other comics and There's stuff. There's been probably 20 roommates since then. I think if we counted. Mike different. Rice. Yep. Austin LaFond. Mm-hmm. Uh, Henderson. Sp- yep, Spillane. Spilsey, Mike Robinson, Mike Robinson, um, Tommy Schneeman, Connor yeah. King, Connor King, some guy named Muhammad who stole everything. Muhammad who stole, <laughs> yeah, which stinks. I was like, this guy is great. Oh, um, McShane, yeah, McShane, Buds, <laughs> Ralph, oh, Buds. Ralph, Ralph. Laguerre, um Wait, what do you mean this guy stole Jor- everything? Oh, Jarrell, Jarrell, no. Jarrell, uh, sh- Kenyon, Kenyon. Kenyon. I mean, that's, holy, that's shit. thirteen, that's 13 fucking roommates, and there's a couple more in too. five years. And the landlords have no idea. <laughs> the landlords couldn't ki- get care. They've lives. never known you had a different roommate, dude. They they probably do, but we'll like text them and be like, "Hello, the ceiling is leaking, b- like blood yeah. right now," <laughs> and they're like, "Good luck." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. They yeah. don't do anything. Like, <laughs> I kind of that's kind of nice if they don't care about that. Also, the thing is that that is nice is that when the place was purchased or when they were like looking for new tenants, like place was brand like almost brand new or something like that like, building was brand new it looks like it's falling apart we have yeah, put we, some years no on way it. yeah I, but there's no way we're getting the damage deposit back i mean dude we have put that thing that place the looks ringer. like it's 50 years old i've been lived in by a family of eight dude the ac yeah. dude the ac and the pipes work amazingly like mm-hmm. the the ac like you you want it hotter it gets hot and Two minutes. Wow. You want to cold? It gets cold. But in two it minutes. has lived and lived in. We've we've really put. Under I mean, those well, 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 the first couple of years, like they were having parties all the time. Yeah, all oh. the time. And House then has been well shaken. It's, and then when I and then you guys would have those uh, the first chills fuck shows. Yeah, there. we would do shows oh, in there. You did shows at your so house. At first, when we moved in there, one house was like the the nicest house on the block, and no one was buying it for like a year and a half. And then the other one was under construction. Oh, so you were all so alone it, on either side. It was we were completely alone. And yeah, we just fucking partied like all, all the time, dude. They but were, now wow. we're now there's no way we. It's two young families on either side. Oh, you can't if do we it did now. that, they would be like, "Excuse me." You had your time though. Yeah, but now I don't even want to. And yeah. now, dude, we have the we have the uh, the meat fires. Like, we have the barbecues in the backyard. Chris is all the, the king time. chef. So yeah, those like, are those are still fun. Yeah, those, those are, are fun. those are great. I think yeah. Going people... camping with Chris when you made that food for us in Door County. Yeah, that was amazing. That's actually yeah. a good listener question that we should take. Why? Uh, someone said, "Your <laughs> sorry, you have to." What's your favorite food dish? <laughs> favorite all-time food dish. Okay, okay. Oh, I think I think Chris is a great yeah, guy. Yeah, this is with. a good. Jeff, person. we'll start with you because your taste buds are nothing. I have great. <laughs> I have a great palate. No. <laughs> the best meal I've ever had, or the best that I've made, or what? Just the best food. Your, your favorite, general? your favorite all-time food. favorite food dish. I guess that's like bond I, me. So let's say, okay, wait, I, I don't know. How about, how about, how about let's, let's do this? Let's do this. Chicken you, wings. This is it. You're getting executed tomorrow. Oh, okay, final last I, meal. I last like that meal. better. I like that a lot. Okay, I would say a bond me with six wings too. Jesus. Six chicken wings. Why not go eight? No, I don't think I, I don't want to have a full stomach. <laughs> when you t- I don't want to poop my pants. If you get shot in the head, you don't want a full stomach. I don't want to. I don't want to shit the bed. You want to be polite even after death. <laughs> yeah. You're like, oh, I'm dead, but I don't want anyone to clean up after me. I don't want to make That'd a mess. Be so rude. Like, <laughs> what about like a shake or something? Uh, okay, maybe a little bowl of cookie dough ice cream. Bowl. Cookie dough, Love cookie bowl. dough not even cream. not even a cone. No <laughs> cones. Cones are overrated. It always falls off. It gets yeah. too hot. Not a cone guy. I would probably that's my final meal. I'd probably do I, a uh, like a really good steak dinner. See, that's way lamer than what I did. That's no. just so obvious. That's so obvious. Dude, steak is really fucking great though. Man. <sighs> yeah, yeah, but when made right. Yeah, boring. 
Yawn. Probably, I probably get honestly. You'd, you'd order in Carabas for your final <laughs> meal. <laughs> no, there's this place called De Stefano's in New York. It's a uh, steakhouse uh, that my buddy took me to. Okay. I went in December. Our bills ended up being like 250 bucks See each. That. It was crazy. Did they charge you for your last meal? Where does it come from? Yeah, that's is a great it ta- is that taxpayer it. money? I mean, they could charge you. You're dead. They could, who, who's yeah. Pay for right. It? Mm-hmm. Do you, is, I want to be like, I want to support a local business. <laughs> I want to support <laughs> yeah. a woman of color owned restaurant, <laughs> please. <laughs> in my final act, Chris, what was your final meal? Oh, man, hmm. I wish I'd, I had. Uh, I mean, honestly. St- Steak is my favorite food. Actually, dude, wow. I'll, I'll, let me take that back. There's a oh, uh, as you join his side, Bob Chin's Bob Chin's crab uh, crab house yeah. in uh, in Wheeling. Yeah. Bob Chin's has the best uh, like king crab. No, like king oh, crab is good. Known for it nationwide. Bob Chin's. It was it was uh, like ranked like second in the country at best crab legs. Who was first? <laughs> yeah, what? How like, do you know yeah, this? Because yeah. they know they because they have they have like the they, oh, they, they print oh, out the rankings. Oh, you're falling for the rankings uh, they post on the wall of the restaurant. It's like the movie and it's like an elf when he's like, <laughs> "Congratulations, <laughs> yeah, best oh. coffee in the world." Yeah. <laughs> okay, if you had Bob Chin's, you guys would. Cause Drago I, falls for oh the my awards God. they give themselves. I would get the crab the claws and the garlic like, rolls and I'd get. Two large king crabs. It's in Wheeling. Where's Wheeling? Massachusetts. Is, is Wheeling's by Arlington Heights? Where's that? It's by Buffalo Grove. Oh my God! It's a suburbs Just thing. Just listing burbs. It's a suburbs thing. It's like thirty minutes away. I've had Bob Chin stinks, and you can put that on record. You're a f- hey, listen, dude. You're fucking. You're out. You're out of your middle uh, of the country you're crab. Your, you're out of your ass. Yeah, right middle now. of the country. Suburban I know. I know. Chicago you, crab. I know what you're thinking. I know what you're thinking. Fresh but, from the Chicago River. But you can fuck yourself. This place. Look up Bob Chin's. I used to think food in the suburbs was good too, and then you grow up. No, dude, this is this is not no this is not typical. This is not typical suburb food. All right, I mean Bob. This looks, is Bob looks like a great time. Uh, Bob looks fun. Yeah, okay. dude. I'll admit that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. How do you fucking oh, say no to that? Oh, he just died. Damn. 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 R. I. P. Oh wow. And, I, and now Real you're one. gonna say he sucks. Go no, fuck yourself. No, I take Jeff. that back. Everything I've said about the Chin family. Dude, the the, the garlic rolls are unbelievable. Go down. Go that down. That does James. look good. See those garlic rolls on the side. That's the bread you get to start, motherfucker. Damn. That does look oh, good. Oh shit, that looks incredible. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm a little high still. It's a little too much food talk. My mom would take me there for my birthday. Oh my birthday. god! Do you get that big crab? Dude, the the Alaskan mm. king crab okay, is huge. That looks incredible. Yeah, that looks really good. Yeah, go but, fuck yourself. But <laughs> can you really screw up crab? It's always good. You just gotta boil it. Yeah, it's always good. And put garlic and butter on it. Doesn't yeah. doesn't matter. What do you mean? Can you screw up? Can you screw up your fucking chicken wings? Yeah, chicken wings gonna be really bad. Yeah, they're can, soft and they're not crispy. Absolutely, they not, can be bad. You could get sick. You can you can fuck yeah, up you can fuck up you can fuck up crab just as easy as you can fuck up no, chicken wings. No, chicken wings are hard to make. They're way easier to make. That's, uh, why, that's why they have them in fucking comedy clubs. Because a because a nineteen year old college wings. freshman can no, make them. No, they have them there because they're cheaper. Yeah, crabs really expensive. Yeah, often. And it would also be very, not always. It would be it's so always like, more. Could you imagine a comedy club where people are crab? Like, like, yeah, they're cracking their crab. to crabs. He ordered the crab legs. Where are you going to do? There's butter shooting everywhere. <laughs> Alaskan oh, yeah. King Crab from Bob Chins. Uh, that's my final meal. Chris, I'm in. I'm into that. I think my fa- I mean, I like a good uh, steak sandwich a lot. Like, mm. with, like. Like on like a ch- like sliced uh, New York strip some steak, garlic on some butter, like, yeah, yeah, garlic butter on a ch- oh. ciabatta with some arugula and horseradish. Oh, damn. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Getting that, a little torqued. I think <laughs> I think that's my oh, that favorite. That sounds good. Do you have like, a dessert? Um, I, mean, I have to I change mine to creme brulee for dessert. Creme brulee is the best. Dessert. You. You've yeah. never had creme brulee? I've had it. It's, y- you. You're such a goon. But not for not for like. Not for good. Not not when not when I'm getting shot in the head tomorrow. What's your what is yours? What's better than that? <laughs> I like how you, we've all been like yeah. executed in its firing squad yeah, every time. Yeah, you, you do. Do you actually think people get shot in the head when they're executed now? Uh, no. But they used to get shot in the in the uh, heart. Yes, they don't do. Only Utah still does it. Utah's the only state. Which that I would I would honestly I'd take me out that way. I'd of much, course, you take firing squad every time. Yeah. Wh- what do they do now? 
the lethal, lethal injection. injection. Ooh, which I which chair you, and maybe a couple still. Yeah, but injection they don't know, right? If it's yeah, what they, do you mean? They don't they, know. They, 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 they don't predict that it's painless, but they they, they, they don't know. There's no way to really. They keep tell. changing it because they keep like suing them because like got this it goes badly sometimes. One guy yeah. like wouldn't die for yeah. like an hour and a half. Jesus Christ! And then they had to like take it out, and he like lived for another two years because like they should have an emergency. They, it didn't work. <laughs> oh my! Look, look this Wait, up, this James. Serious? I want to make sure that's true. Something really so, bad <laughs> happened. When they're they just like, our, our, our bad, our bad. I just, I, I'm yeah. almost positive a guy <laughs> you survived. Get to, a you get to live now. Okay. No more death row Sorry, for you. You're, you're alive now. Dude, no way. Who survived a botched lethal injection attempt ah, dies dude. of cancer. <laughs> <I> mean, <laughs> of course like, he did. He Doyle Ham couldn't get a break. Uh, Doyle. Two and a half hours of unsuccessful. His task, name was bro. Doyle Lee Ham. Oh, they couldn't get the. They just couldn't get a. An IV line into him, so maybe they didn't actually put the they thing should, into him. They should have like an like an axe on the wall with like glass you break in case of emergency. Just bet, <laughs> yeah. just fuck, Chop off not the head. Yeah. just <laughs> bet him. They should have like a baseball bat. Yeah, just, yeah. Oh just my just god, like, it's like a you know. Oh my god, it's like a fire. It's like a fire there's another. There's guy. another one. There's multiple. Of yeah, they all. He they, dies of COVID. They all die of oh terrible my diseases god. afterwards. Dude, that's, so sad. that's how many. But it makes you think they're probably guilty, you know. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> the world, least, like it was meant they're supposed to die. At obviously. least 17 people sentenced to death in four states have died of COVID 19. We got to go back wow. to gun. Don's Gun Depot. Call him up. Don's Gun Depot. This is our new sponsorship. Really? We do. We got to do. Yeah. <laughs> the official gun of Indiana's execution yeah, chamber. Alabama <laughs> State Death Row. Brought to you by Don's Gun Depot. <laughs> Dude, give me the. Shoot him in the head. <laughs> give me the Bin Laden treatment. You okay. know that. The firing squad, they only give like two of them a real bullet, and everyone else gets a blank, so they don't want them to feel guilty about <laughs> killing them. I, I really? See, so you just don't know. Not who. everyone. They don't know if they actually killed them or not. They hand them a rifle, and they're like, use this, and they six or eight of them shoot it or something like that. Oh, come on. That's, you signed up for the job. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. kind of agree. I like how this is news. Like it's it's on hold for now. <laughs> South, yeah, South Carolina is planning. We'll fucking shoot you, Richard. If it's the last thing we do. They Dude. were trying to bring back the firing squad in South Carolina. I mean, they... can you can you imagine them? They're like, hey, uh, so we don't know if we're gonna shoot you or not. We're, we'll let you know in a month. It could be the injection, but you're getting it. Okay, like, in one just, way or another, uh, we got you. We don't know which one it is yet, so <laughs> just go back to your, just go think about that for a month. I, mean, <laughs> I get freaked out by such less indecision. Like I'm like, I don't know how I'm going to travel to Denver next month. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> like, like, oh oh god. my god. This guy's like, am I going to get poisoned or am I going to get electrocuted <laughs> or am I going to get machine done? They used yeah, they used to do the public hanging too. The guillotine. I say bring back the guillotine. Mm. A class. No, that's good. I heard the I heard, yeah, public hangings. Used no, because some be people like, are still alive from the guillotine, right? No, no the head, the head, really. Oh, that's, the the, there was an experiment. Off. No, so there yeah, was an experiment like done where someone was was executed, and before he was executed, the 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 scientist carrying out the experiment was like, "Hey, if you." Are still conscious? Oh my God! Blink ten times no. in a row, oh. and he did it. Oh, his, so his you're... head, his head blinked ten yeah. times. So he was fully oh aware God. of everything after he cut his head. But the brain's disconnected. It probably the lives for like a few minutes. But your, spinal your cord. eyes are in your head. So the the, 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 fi the firing wow. squad is the only is the only way the out. The firing squad's the way to that's, go. That's God's way. I like way. how none of us have just gone with the option of like maybe maybe the death penalty shouldn't be. Well, a thing. Yeah. <laughs> no. All of us are like we gotta kill him somehow. I no, mean, yeah, no, I mean no. you're right. There should not be. This there is should a, not this be. Is America, this is America. Every life is precious. It unless, is <laughs> unless it we want to kill you <laughs> with a firing squad. Dude, it is kind of yeah. The, I mean, you are right. That up, same politician was like abortion. Up, <laughs> It's murder. <laughs> yeah. But I want to shoot that guy. Bring back the firing squad. Yeah, the death penalty upon further review is not as cool as we once thought. <laughs> <laughs> Drago used to love the death penalty. <laughs> oh, dude. There, I was, You're watching C-SPAN when Timothy McVeigh got killed. Oh, they I was so watching. into They it. showed that shit on TV. They really? showed that shit. Oh, yeah. They always show the executions. They don't think they show the actual needle going in, but they'll show the people. Watch. People watch it. What? It's like a watching chamber. I didn't know. I didn't like, know. it's like family and friends, but oh, they come and I, watch it. I thought you were saying it was, like, televised. No, it, I mean, they televised parts of it, Jeez. like, setting it up and stuff. Yeah, Probably not the actual death. 
It's like so one of the CNN oldest. shows like a guy. People like, in like the 1800s, that like 50,000 people would watch yeah. a public hanging. Oldest form of it entertainment. Was, yeah, it was like the original entertainment. Yeah. Seeing a guy hung. They would, 50,000 people would turn up to watch a guy get hung. The whole like Happened point all of, the time. Yeah, town squares were where you like did justice and yeah. the whole town was like, some cases they would be like, everyone has to show up. Yeah, yeah. We're making an example. Right. It was like a revolutionary or something. Yeah. yeah. During the French Revolution, if you didn't go to executions, they're like, mm-hmm. then like you're next. What's your <laughs> What is your deal? Huh? Yeah. <laughs> that was a f- the first historical fact I've seen Drago actually vaguely interested in. <laughs> that is actually really cool. Yeah. <laughs> See, that one got him. Drago's okay. Like, Shit, dude. So like, do they have like tournaments and stuff? Yeah. <laughs> Could you be good at that? <laughs> yeah. Could yeah. you be competitive at that? Can you go? Can you get a scholarship for that? People's yeah. job. <laughs> there was the guy's job. He was the executioner. He so he just, wo- he, he just woke up. Who do Every I got? Every day he just killed a new person. I just got to mm-hmm. clock in. London just yeah. had a head Chop ex- a dude. Yeah. <laughs> just ch- go chop. He's <laughs> complaining to his wife. He's like, like, oh, <laughs> man. I saw a guy blink 25 times. Kids these days <laughs> just have thicker necks yeah. than when they used to. Yeah. Yeah. They just don't snap as easily as they used to. I was hanging this guy and he shit all over my boots. <laughs> it just... He peed and shit all over me. Yeah, they, oh they're my. not giving me new boots. It's yeah. such a fucking... My hood's hot in the summer. The hood is hot the in the summer. <laughs> God. Oh, dark pod. Yeah. A dark pod. I, I don't mind it. Okay, let's switch gears because okay. actually, because we do, we do, we do have another question that I think is good for Chris to have because he's okay. also a, he's also a fellow road dog. He's out there uh, dealing with a bunch road of different types dog. of crowds. The one I mean, but- Drago thinks he's a road dog and he works Rockford once a month. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. okay. One, Stolen valor. One question. <laughs> one question that we had. Uh, New York is the road. <laughs> uh, yeah. He flies uh, and does a Bushwick bodega yeah, yeah, bo- show. He's bo- like, bodegas. I'm a road dog. Co- coffee shop. Coffee yeah, shop in, okay. in Bushwick. Uh, one guy asked recently, any have you had any recent uh, drunken drunken heckler uh, drunken crowd stories that you've had this year, 2022? Anything that sticks out to you, Higginbottom, talk to me. Like immediately, I forget the town. It was like some small town in southern. I forget southern, the town. It was some small town in southern Illinois that I went to, <laughs> and it wasn't just like one. It was like the whole audience was just like, "This is what it is." Like we're not, others were yelling. They were just they were it, they were paying attention, but they were like every joke that you had. They were like, "But what if?" <laughs> yeah, like, they were like giving me tags. Like they they weren't. They, They're like, "No way!" Yeah, yeah. Like it wasn't. No one was laughing. They're like, "That's." crazy like, <laughs> like structurally that was good yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, be like, good tag brother <laughs> that was a good setup punch right there <laughs> misdirection <laughs> yeah no, it was just they were just talking the Small whole time town people don't know how to be quiet it, they don't it was just i it was like the first i get the curse of doing like the first show Oh, at a venue all the yeah. time. People are like, "It's our first show. We don't really know what we're doing." <laughs> oh yeah. Let's have fucking Chris come down and bomb. I don't know. I just, I had a fun time. I ended up having a good time. Just like yelled at, yelled. You know at what happens? I time. come back the next week, and they're like, "Man, there were way more people at the first show." <laughs> 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 Some That's guy fine. ruined the whole. Yeah, vibe. <laughs> it's always Jeffrey. You should have been there last month, Osmos. No, yeah. It, I mean, that. yeah, definitely. Forget that town, but it was just like a bar. I, every I was it wasn't even on a stage. It was like standing in a corner. Oh yeah. And everybody else was also standing. They knew there was a show. It wasn't like an. They amp, were standing an the whole time. People were standing or like sitting at high tops, and I was barely like I was. <laughs> you were at their level. Yeah. I, <laughs> yeah. I yeah. love that. I love comedy. I went to Decatur with uh, Tim Smith. And we mm-hmm. had there was there was one guy that was with his that was like uh, in like a Illinois uh, hat and he just like probably fifty year old dude and he was just like every fucking yeah. joke he had something to say and he was with his wife who was just like so proud that he was chiming in oh you know? she was happy and then what sucks is I don't even think he was drunk like I don't think he was like drunk and they just don't have they don't know how to deal with stimuli. A lot, they, they're not used to social I, settings. A lot of those ti- those people, like I've get, I've getting you get the people who talk every punchline, and they come up to you afterwards and they're like, you know, I've always thought about being a comedian. That's what you're it like, is. So just do it. Like, yeah, get, get on stage. You, like the wife's probably or the lady's just like, you're so funny, baby. Like, I, <laughs> like, like, oh my god, that you're so much better than all them. You could do like, that. You, you should, could do that. You should get up there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah. Live, you make up. everyone laugh at Christmas. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's like, I just don't know where to get up in Cape Girardeau, Missouri. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you know, I can't move to a town with liberals. Goddamn, yeah. gotta stay out. I of made here. Mencia laugh at Zanies in 1984. Yeah. <laughs> maybe that's <laughs> what they. Show. I think maybe that's what they think. 
that they're doing that they, some people do think that no they helping. think they're helping the yeah. show i actually got i think i just i think i i don't think i got into an argument with the comic about this but i was talking to someone in uh, in new york about this that one guy said uh that uh women are better audience members than men and the other guy said that men were better audience members than women uh, i think yeah. it's i think it's tradition uh. i think it's Probably Alex s- still lives in the binary world, Chris. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think it's. I think it's. And what about they them? Uh-huh. I think it's probably sixty the percent. Yeah. I don't have an opinion. I think sixty five percent of the time guys are. Uh, uh I think on average men are better, but what the worst men get worse than women. If that makes sense, the peaks. But are but worse. like dude, like like the show we did in Louisville, like there were the four women, like the two were like the the best that they were laughing oh, the whole ripped. time. Sixty year old women who are with it love me. <laughs> <laughs> Drunk women who are kind of over their husband. Those are my demographic. <laughs> <laughs> this was the part of the show that I was worried about. Right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we talk about who loves yeah. the baby. Which one? Which one's worse, women or women? <laughs> <laughs> older women or younger? Yeah. Which kind of women do we hate the most? <laughs> <laughs> Rate the European races. I think uh, nothing's uh, worse than an, an overconfident man. I think that's it, always the well, worst. The, like, yeah. And they come up to you afterwards and they have no recollection or like ability to be like, sorry, I was a piece of shit. The They're whole like, time. I love Rogan, man. I know yeah. I'm just trying to make it hard for you up there. Like, dude, you know <laughs> Legion of Skanks? I'm like, get the fuck out of here. I think the one guy, yeah. I think sometimes the, the problem with why guys are sometimes bad audience members is that they're upset that you're making their like girlfriend oh, laugh. We're cucking all right. of them. Some men are like, there's no, oh, he's probably not funnier than me. And then you are. And then you're like, and they're like laughing and they're like, and then smiling they get, yeah, the more. girlfriend's so hyped. They haven't smiled like that in years. So he's like, oh, fuck, he's this like, I used to make her smile. Right, right, right. Now he's like, why is she, why is she laughing at this Serbian man making my wife smile? Mm-hmm. I mean, men, men, if there are shows you want to go to where you don't feel threatened by how funny the comedians are, fucking DM me. I'll <laughs> yeah, we'll na- t- yeah, I'll give you the name of the shows. You can go there. <laughs> we'll find Find you a lineup that won't make yeah, your girlfriend. I, they're not. They're not worried know, about a Jeff some, stealing. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 <laughs> I know some comics that you, no worries. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you'll be fine. If Drago's working on some new, bring your date. Oh, He'll be fine. That, that's the truth. <laughs> wasn't Dra- it wasn't Drago. He's too I tall. I know. He's, he's too tall. He's, he's tall he's, and funny. They're women are. Like, he can protect me while making me laugh. Oh, the, the whole thing on this pod is that Jeff says I'm not funny, so oh. you can't. We can't do you that. Can't say that. He makes me laugh. Yeah. <laughs> he makes me laugh, but it's not. <laughs> See, it's, 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 it's not a good bit, thing. The bit, the bit is. Uh, the I'm bit, laughing the, at him, not with him. I right. will admit, there's some times where I'm like, duh, it, where, duh, that was funny, and Drago's just like, I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just like, come on, like, are you kidding me? Wait, like at a show, or like we'll be watching like uh, like a great sitcom, and he's oh, like, oh mm, no. no. <laughs> Yeah, no, this isn't. This I'm isn't, not fun. This sometimes. isn't good. How I is, really. How is Kramer opening a door funny? Yeah, yeah. He's just <laughs> opening the door. Like, Jerry's just. He's just dating another woman. What's funny about that? Oh yeah, his hair <laughs> sticks up and it jiggles. Oh yeah, all right. Uh, I can. George open a door. is just yelling again. Yeah, I don't just, get it. I could be. Just, I can open a door. He's just opening it. I would say some shit like yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> Newman. Yes. Newman's nothing. <laughs> He, he just, would. He's just opening a door. And Elaine, <laughs> and Elaine, dude, like get her off the screen. <laughs> 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 Women aren't funny in sitcoms. I don't oh, want to just have money. Oh, come on. Oh, we're kidding. We're, I Little done joke. It. <laughs> Little joke. But yeah, I, I could see that, Drago. <laughs> like, was Char- they- like Charlie Day, dude? Too squeaky. I don't like that. <laughs> too squeaky. <laughs> They drink too much on that Sony. <laughs> <laughs> They're always drunk. It's just, yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's not realistic. He always gets mad at me for being high on the podcast. Drago's such a narc. He's way. Like, he they, gets way too they, high. They, they the smoke too much in that seventy. Chris, show. Chris being high is way different than you being high. He can handle it better than I can. That's true. You I don't hit. I don't vape. And I, I don't know if do Chris that. is high or not. I know when you're high. Yeah, for sure. That's for a sure. huge problem. Let me tell you. <laughs> it's not a problem. <laughs> yeah. Well, it might be because it's just like, uh, we're, again, the living together thing. It's yeah, like you the, know his levels. You go, you go like nose blind to how high I am. <laughs> right. I mean? like, you yeah, can't. you don't smell the weed. Dude, on before we would do big shows, Chris used to get like, I think you would get kind of nervous for sets. You would you would smoke big ones yeah. before sets. Oh, yeah. yeah. I you feel don't like smoke, we all used to get drunk. You don't high, smoke yeah. as much anymore, right? No, before definitely sets. not. But it was like a nerves thing. But then sometimes you'd smoke the wrong. 
long <laughs> strain. Oh, and like no. sometimes it helps with the nerves, and sometimes it's like, oh whoa, nerves oh, have been my God. absolutely <laughs> pedaled to the metal. Like I am <laughs> fucked. You're just like freaking. You out get up there, there and just say hey like four times. <laughs> <on top. laughs> hey, hey, uh, hey, oh fuck, hey. <laughs> oh my it's like, keep God. Keep restarting. Have your you, set. you okay? Especially like at the comedy bar, big room. Did you have ever have any moments? You're only a couple years in. You're either featuring or headlining, or whatever. Do you ever have? You're doing a long set. Were you ever too high at the comedy bar? Yeah, and drunk. Too high and drunk. Mm. Oh, yeah. dude, that room is scary. Dude, too. My, one of my first weekends there, I fell up the stairs in front of the owner. Oh. <laughs> like, I, like I was, I was like, "What's up? Good to see you guys. Thanks for the opportunity." Oh, like, oh. Just, like, we like took a nice tumble up, up, <laughs> oh. at least up though. I did, that like, the old comedy bar was one of the toughest rooms in comedy. It really was to be high, seventy too foot high tall for ceilings. That. Everyone there worked at Dell or. something. Something. Right, right, right. It was right. just you or couldn't get IBM. a consistent group of people. You'd get no. like one table or four tables that were all like that were like, yeah, I get this guy, and then everybody else was like, I've never been out of Kentucky before. Yeah. I will, yeah. I will it say this though, dude, crushing that. at that old room, you felt oh like a fucking god. god. You, were a king. Yeah. you felt like a uh-huh. god, and there were people like. It it wasn't impossible. Like there no, were no, 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 could no. Do yeah. well, like yeah. you could do it consistently, and there were people that were like, "Dude, that that place sucks." On the, like, no, maybe you had to really involve the crowd. Yeah, on, it, the sh- on the show, on the showcase, if yeah. you went up early in the showcase, it was tougher. But like on the like the third, like Kyle's old show on the Thursday showcase, if you went like third or fourth, you would fucking crush. There. Yeah, those were fun. You I would like, really crush. I, yeah. It was a. We can say it now. It was a terrible room for comedy, and I'm glad they moved to their new location. Yeah, their new location's great. The new location rips. Yeah. yeah. But that old one was, I would not. The old one was really pretty. Like, it was a beautiful room. It beautiful. Was the, it was the prettiest room. You felt room like a yeah, fucking yeah. god. You yeah. really, you felt awesome. You like, just man. can't have those 50-foot ceilings. No, high ceilings in comedy don't. It does great, not work. Aren't, a, aren't a, always a winning combo. No. Mm-hmm. Rarely. I I haven't been, I, I, I've never smoked before sets. I, I would love you to did, see you high You up did there. once. The, really? When? We went, to right. a, we went to an open mic when we were first starting, and I was like, <laughs> see? And I was smoking yes. a joint out in front, and I was like, you want to hit? And you're like, fuck, man, I've never really gotten high before, but I'll oh, do it. Oh, wow. And then you bombed, and you came outside, and you're like, never, ever let me smoke. <laughs> He's like, don't ever let me smoke. I bet you're true, so dude. in your head if you're high up there. I just, I couldn't even remember what I was even trying to say. Yeah. Oh, I was just you like, forget everything? E- blank. Yeah. Really? Blank, yeah. Full blank. And the audience Shooting is blanks. howling. I They're mean, like, this, these, these open micers were like, this guy sucks ass. <laughs> yeah, but, Drago, you were bad at the beginning. <laughs> Let's we talk were. about we it. I, and everyone was. You guys just yeah. didn't have to see me be bad. I was, I was bad particularly bad. No, but Chris, you got booked pretty. Well, at least well, didn't, you were, didn't you start in Tampa, Chris? Well, you, I did. I did some like open mics when I was in. But college. you were you were working oh, okay. the you were working comedy bar pretty quickly though. Yeah, I like I got lo- I got lucky where I was supposed to um, do a guest spot, and then the host thought the show started at eight rather than seven thirty. So Whoa. I just got tossed hosting a weekend show. And then after of, that, they booked you and a I, lot. I guess I did well hosting. And I had no idea. They were like, have you ever hosted before? And I had not. And I was just like, yes, I have. <laughs> For I sure. had seen it enough, kind yeah, of. Yeah. And then I just, you know, you do what you, you just pretend. Oh, yeah. yeah. And yeah. I pretended well enough to where they were like, yeah, he's hosted before. Or they were That's like, that huge. was ballsy. Yeah. So, like, so they would like give you like a, like, a, like the month residency. And then, yeah, you yeah, started you getting, were... those were brutal, though. Like, they were good. They were great. Like, definitely Hosting always makes you a better comic. Host. Yeah. Hosting is the hardest part of comedy. But like yeah. those yeah. months where you were going back to the city, I wouldn't want to do that at like almost any club. I think going back to one club four weekends in a oh, row. It's like to 35 do the same, shows. And oh to do the God. same job every time, to just host every time. You like, can't get creative even when you're Even hosting. like, yeah, even like some of like the, if you were going to do the weekends at the Lincoln Lodge on Fridays and Saturdays, which are like arguably some of the like better rooms in the city. The or, lodge, the lodge is incredible. Yeah, like if you were, go- I would love to do that every single weekend, but that would still be like, all right, I gotta change. Like you could stir but, crazy. But the, the problem, the thing with the lodge, the only difference is the lodge. If you hosted two like shows there, you can get you can do it. You, you can, can do a different around. set. Yeah, but you to can be a host creative. at comedy bar, you kind of got or at any club, you kind of got to be a hack. You have to be like, first, like yeah, you have to be like yeah. a bulletproof. You hack it up. You're like, where yeah. are you from? How'd you meet? Comedy yeah. bar doesn't or, like. Sorry, Lincoln. Lodge doesn't you don't really they don't if anything you shouldn't you you don't want to be a hack in that room yeah, yeah they like don't want you to do anything like if you do the uh where are you froms or whatever it's like like you can do that for like a minute or whatever but like they don't you, have much interest they'll just be like if you just get into the bits like it's no, ca- yeah. on, it's kind of like a comedy on state vibe in a way yeah, where like yeah. they want you just to get into it and be 
That's it's, the comedy club in Madison, Wisconsin. Listeners. Yeah, really. That's yeah. where Jeff started when he was where he was bad. Apparently. Yeah. Oh yeah, look how he puts it in quotes because he knows it's not true. He well, knows I, I was mean, killing it the whole time. Who it was I've, also tough to bomb there. Who was t- who was telling me stories of 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 young of young starting as no at comedy really on state. someone was, I was kind of wild. I yeah, did wild shit on stage. Doing. I just remember when you were first <clears> here, you'd like bring up a whole pile of books. <laughs> Sla- slam them onto the, the 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 stool. Not address them once, and then bring them off stage. <laughs> yeah. you. Sometimes you would be like getting into the book. Bu- Sometimes I do the book bit. The yeah. book bit, but other times you're like, guess the book bit didn't happen. I just brought <laughs> five he- volumes on stage. Yeah. That was so. That was funny. my. Fa- I I liked it as not addressing. The no, books. I think it was kind of funny. I yeah. I wish I did that shit still. That shit was fun. They're very fun. I used to bring up poster boards and stuff. I was mm-hmm. a big I, prop guy. I was genuinely bad for like six. months months though i I, mean, I saw you me and jenna hated you dude it was so yeah. it was so hard to come like i mean starting in chicago would suck yeah i like i came from you know the tampa st pete college like doing open mics every like two months and thinking i had something because all of my college friends didn't they i was the only person who oh would was you even, just kill yeah. every show well like did well because i my friends were like there's it was a small school and like in a like a sleepy town that well, not a whole like not sleepy but there wasn't a whole lot to do right right you know you would you'd be like all right well the comedy show's happening so i got gassed up early oh and yeah. then i came to chicago and was like i'm gonna just hit the ground running for sure i'm very, i'm good and then i got that i almost don't even that's why i like sometimes when people ask me how long i've been doing it i usually kind of just do a half for when i was in st Pete. you don't count the yeah, no it, feel, it was like it doesn't a, count no i didn't do stand up there right i like right. did yeah, i did yeah. my dumb stone thoughts in front of my friend but it crushed yeah and then i those, came those college shows are so great. i i sucked too i but i had this idea that i knew what i was doing you like, need that you need that too. i think so it was an you advantage need that, that ego I, I, I remember one time like yeah, it was bubble. i know it was bad because one time terrence brought me up he I, I i got off stage and he brought me off stage by going he goes give it for alex guys he's he's actually getting pretty good at this <laughs> <laughs> Like it was like he, it was, they were which, a surprise. Which yeah, he was like he's actually getting good at this. Which well, you was were like, doing really dark stuff for a while. You were doing this like Serbian genocide jokes. Oh or yeah, 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 up top. Yeah. I don't remember that. But yeah. I remember that. You were really unlikable. I was too. In a well, you were unlikable in a douchebag way. I was like a virgin well, I, to like kill anyone. I just didn't have any stage presence. I right. didn't know how to be. Uh, it's better, to, I, dude. It would. I, I mean, sometimes people are like the. The, he's really nice. I'm like, please don't let that be the first thing you say about me. Oh no 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 no! You like, don't want that, that. That's like that means you're not good at comedy. If you say that's a that's a yeah. If someone says the comic's nice, that means they're not good. Yeah, it's like a hundred percent of the time. Like, yeah, I'd rather be like known for like, yeah, he's an asshole and he's got a bunch of success. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like no one. He's an asshole, like, but regardless, goddamn it, he's got know? a hot ten though. I remember Dragovich. You came outside of. Uh, of like an open mic and you're like if i hear one more fucking sports ball joke I'm oh like, yeah the fuck out. oh my god and then oh, i was yeah. like thank you <laughs> like, I, I was oh, like yeah. i thought i was gonna have to pretend to be a fucking nerd the whole time i live i was like all right yeah. now i live in chicago i guess i have to not like sports now if i want to uh-huh. do comedy the like scene I, the scene was very i think that's why that partly and partly the scene was so like welcoming to like jenna jeff and toller immediately because oh, you go. guys were these uh you know nerdy loser oh funny my people. god there's nothing wrong with that that's like you guys were you guys were part of like what a comedian was supposed to be and we were like in hip. We were hip comics back then. Yeah. I would say, yeah, we yeah, were yeah, yeah. There hip. was definitely a movement like of flannel. Like alt, alt comedy was a lot bigger five years ago than it is now. Wow, that's actually really true. Alt comedy so kind of took bigger. a nose dive. Like oh, the, alt comedy, yeah, did kind of. You don't see guys going up there and doing one liners very often that, anymore. That might be in <laughs> Chicago though, because I think really it might be that we had our like two. We had like two, like two, like alt, like the queens here they right were like i mean that are famous running now. everything and then they left in a hu- just a huge are you, vacuum. Are, you, are you talking about meg stalter and, and Sarah? Sarah? Yeah, oh yeah yeah, yeah. It's so amazing yeah. yeah and then i mean you and then you also had like the late late breakfast people leave yeah you can't really I, top that and that was like an alt open mic basically like it gave people room to pr- like fuck around we, we also right. had, yeah, you, you, had, you had steve castillo was here too steve doing all shit steve, steve malden steve malden steve. Yeah. oh yeah. my god so funny yeah yeah, so yeah. Funny. like a lot i mean there's probably some great people that that are gonna come up hopefully but like i don't know yeah it feels like chicago has everyone used to have remember like there's five a, years ago everyone used to have a joke that was like this is my impression of steve buscemi uh, 
playing oh, pool. Oh, yeah. And it would just be like one line. <laughs> yeah, and then yeah, the joke yeah. was that the impression sucked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone, and then, and then <laughs> yeah, it was like, yeah. next impression, yeah, yeah, Brad yeah. Pitt riding a horse. <laughs> well, dude, there's <laughs> like, actually... Uh, uh, the dude, Sam Otter, runs a really good show at Crushes. That's like a fucking... That's an oh, old yeah, that's show. An old yeah. show. Yeah. That's a really cool show. Where is that? Is that, is that a live one on Sundays? A fish bar, a fish band bar. It's amazing. That bar is awesome. It's a great bar. Yeah, it is a good bar. They they used to Matt Kennedy used to run the uh Used Matt to run Kennedy, a Uncle Mac, the guy I came on the back of listeners. I got a, I got an <laughs> Uncle Matt story from New York, actually. Uncle Matt, we're gonna appreciate. have him call into the pod one day. You guys that meet is, him. That would rule. We're Dude, you could never that. air the pod. No, he couldn't. We couldn't. So I was staying in my buddy Pat's room for nine straight days, and then so Pat comes back on the tenth day, and did so, you have sex in the room? No, you didn't come. No. Wow. Oh, uh, I mean, I, I uh, you came in his bed. Yeah, that's you. normal. Masturbated a couple times, but I clean, I clean, I washed. If the you're sheets. saying you can stay in my room, you're also you're basically saying, you, is that what you you're can, agreeing to? You can jerk off in my room. Really? I, yeah, I, yeah. I did. I, I washed the sheets that's on fair. on day nine. Yeah. I, I promise you. Be respectful. You I yeah. I, I wouldn't wash the sheets. So. I know you wouldn't, Jeff. <laughs> I would. I know you would. I'd take them off the bed and put them in the hamper, but I wouldn't wash. That's so funny. Here's some fucking work <laughs> Here's for you. Some to do. laundry. To welcome, do. welcome home. Welcome home. <laughs> you can see on the mattress exactly where I piss. <laughs> All right, so check. I took the fucking <laughs> oh. sheets off. <laughs> That's, where, that's, where it's my, that's my wet dream right there. <laughs> I do have wet dreams still. I know. That's tight, dude. Good for you. You don't? You guys don't? No. I Not mean, very often. It's probably 30. like twice a year. I but. definitely, like, I wouldn't mind that. Are you kidding me? It's I, fun. I would love to go back to just just waking up and being like, great, I came. That's awesome. You what walk, a great dream. You wake up and think you're peeing, but then it's cum. That'd be t- it's okay, cool. I, 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 <laughs> I'm not. I'm not gonna go that. I'm like thinking it's pee. I don't great. Know. I I think great. I came is the right way to think of it. Yeah, you're like, all right. I got a little mess to clean up, but fucking. Why would you not want to come in your sleep? <laughs> Why would you rule that out of your life? No, because hands? that so would you're tr- too much of an adult. You don't want more joy. It's that like would be shot. that would be. Yeah, <laughs> it's like no hands behind the with no hands. Yeah, look, look, look. It would be insane. It would be insanely inconvenient. Why is it inconvenient? Just to wake up all gooey. Ah, it's your own goo. You're yeah. gross. Uh, you, th- your these are the goo. wrong guys yeah, to talk about too, hygiene. We're grimy. We don't mind goo. <laughs> the the yeah, goo what's boys. Wrong with little goo. <laughs> the two goobers. You came from the goo. <laughs> what's wrong with a little goo? <laughs> we're all goo. We're all goo at the end of the you day. You were made from the goo, and from the goo to the goo, you were turned. No, <laughs> no, uh-huh. I can't. Jeff, you you really wouldn't mind wait just to get that just to get that shot out. I do it. I it mean, happens. I, get, I would get it off me quickly yeah i'm not i'm not like boom i'm laying would, in it Ooh, yay i, I get up like, and wipe i can it off. see jeff going i can't see you going Ooh, i'm not oh, like yeah. aaron touch it i'm <laughs> i'm sticky no yeah t- clean the goo i can see that i can genuinely see that yeah i might do that once poor, smell it poor lady okay so here's what happened matt, <laughs> oh, matt yeah, kennedy sorry, oh, nine sorry. days uh nine days in a row i stay uh on this bed in this room and, and matt stays on the couch okay All nine days yeah oh and uh, and then the last day the guy comes down the 10th day. So I get moved to the couch and we're like, Matt, where are you going to stay? And Matt's like, Oh, don't worry about it. I'm going to go. I've been hanging out with this girl. I'm going to go, go to this girl's place tonight. So we're like, Oh, okay, fine. Whatever. And, uh, that night women love Matt. <laughs> I mean, he's a, he's a good looking, <laughs> good looking guy. But women man. love that Matt. night. He's a lot it, of fun. Instead of I have something that looks like apparently something happening with that girl. Cause oh, she no. said, no, Five in the morning, I hear Matt stumbling up the stairs oh, to no. this apartment with two girls. <laughs> <laughs> to the apartment you're staying to at. To the with apartment your that we're staying at Don't with worry, my baby, friends. I got a floor. And he brings these two girls onto the roof to hang out until the, to watch the sunrise, basically. <laughs> what? Yeah. I mean, the guy knows how to live. The guy he, just. He never stops. He's just, and he's like ballsy, too. He's just like. I'll bring him back to this roof that's not mine. Yeah, like he's I, he, yeah he literally. How did like, he get in? I think he literally was like, I don't have a bed, so I'll just I'll just watch the sunrise with these. Did girls he tell the time. girls what the deal was, or they thought? I, that I was imagine his spot? I imagine he told them, like, hey, there's a good roof to watch the sunrise, <laughs> and they just stayed up all night. Uh, so I will. I, I mean, he will because I had my flight. It's uh, I was I had getting an Uber at six thirty, so he woke me up at five. I went back to sleep until six. Yeah. I woke up at six to get ready and shit. They're still up there just having a ball. At <laughs> oh my six god! Yeah, dude, in the morning, you so love so that. much. So Matt kind of timed this perfectly because like now I'm leaving in a half hour. If he wants to kick these girls out, he's got the couch now. Is that so what he, he did? He, he kicked him out. He knew I, that this was happening. He was like, I'm, yeah, he's, he's like, Drago's like leaving at six thirty. I'm gonna have to just, 
fucking figure it out. It's six thirty. And he slept sun's, on the yeah. Sun's up. Did the like, women just went home? I don't. I I actually don't know what happened. I just know that they were there until six <sighs> and probably past six. You do love a man who knows how to live life to its fullest. The kid. Oh, we were we were. I just don't have that in me. He came with me to my shows like in the East Village. I had like two or three shows. We were just bopping around shows. Two or three shows a night. Okay. I was. Uh, yeah, that's I did. Fair. You do too, right? <laughs> <laughs> I just hate to see the man Je- shine. Je- Jeff can't I hate be- to see no, the man Jeff shine. genuinely can't be happy. I'm for like him, such yeah. a. I feel I'm like not. you guys have been like trying to do what your podcast is about, where it's kind of argue with no, each other. No, I know you're not and a I, negative and guy. I've been like, I've been like, fellas, fellas, <laughs> fellas, please, please. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like, Drago's that, funny. You're funny. Yeah, Come you guys on. are both great. Yeah. None of you are idiots. <laughs> What's going on? Here? <laughs> Neither of you. Are no idiots. one's an idiot, dude. Come we'll on. We'll rename the podcast. No one's an idiot. You're beautiful. No one's an idiot. Just call it. You're beautiful. We're all smart and beautiful with Chris. Higgins. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. It's good. You're the first person who's fought against the negativity. It's good. Well, it's, it, it, usually, Most people buy into it. Usually a guest, like a it. guest takes a side and will like shit on the other person. Yeah, I feel like Tim kind of decided with Alex. Lucia was on my side for sure. The oh. women's side, Maddie sided with me. No, dude. Maddie shit on your life, no, dude, for didn't. a half hour straight. James, 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 please back me up here. It was heavily weighted against you, Jeff. Yeah, what the fuck is wrong with you? Are you a psycho? I, I have, love that. I, we, she was with me. She was with me. How do you, the, the way you're... I a, have to review the tape, please. Look, the way like, you remember things is absolutely incredible. I got all these people with me. Looks behind him. No one's, <laughs> no one's there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Get them, girl. Uh, everyone wants to suck the dinky. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, no one wants you to. You have to have a bit of an ego in this business. <laughs> yeah, and I true. do. Yeah, yeah, do. yeah, man, it's weighing on me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think Maddie was on my side, but I'll, I'll, I'll defer. I'll defer. I'll defer to it. I'm, I mean, am I crazy? No, you're not. You're well, not. You're not crazy. I'll dude. DM Maddie Smith later and ask her. We have she, clips she that are watch, dead. We, we have clips episode. that are dedicated to her, like. <laughs> You think Destroying I'm going to watch this you. podcast? Okay. Come <laughs> <laughs> on. All right. Well, we are also at minute 45. We're at minute 45. We uh, got to read the ad. We got to do Alex a question for Alex. Actually, okay, Alex, I have a great question for you. Talk to me. This month, May, is uh, AAIP Heritage Month. What do you think AAPI stands for? AAPI? Yeah. Chris, do you know this one? Don't answer. I, don't answer. I know what it – no, not – not letter for letter, I don't think accurately. You should know half know of it, it. I know what it's, it's for, yeah. Come on, Alex. You don't know a single letter? AAIP? AAPI. Oh, AAPI. It doesn't. I think you guys have said it differently every time. It's AAPI. <laughs> That's how I wrote it. It's AAPI. AAPI. A-A-P-I. Drago, this could be your final fall. <laughs> this is, if you don't get a single one... That's racist. American? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> America. It's America, America. American Antifa. <laughs> oh, my God. People. You, you're on Twitter more than anyone I know. Yeah, people tweet this shit all the I time. Actually, I actually haven't been uh, on That's Twitter. That's actually much. good, but you York, still should. Yeah, two. he's <laughs> in <New> Anti-abortion. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> so far off. You have think, no idea. All right, think about this. He said you'd be racist if you didn't know heritage is one of yeah oh native american something nope yeah native aa yeah it's native american american why would you think that would be what it stood for heritage aa and you said native american oh no now i'm just we're just we're throwing shots in the dark here you just have no respect asian american pacific islander heritage month james cue up the apology music Hello, Asians. How we doing? This is your boy, Alex. Oh, and Pacific Islanders. Thank you. It's your boy. I missed the mark. And I think Indians. Oh, and Indians? Pipe might be. No, I don't think so. No. No. Well, great people. <sighs> Chris, Rich. you have the apology for Chris, Rich too. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, guys. I, lo- I love what you've been doing. I put up what you're putting down. I've never had a bad thing to say. There we go. I yeah. didn't know that. I didn't know the month. He had his first Bond Me less than a couple weeks ago. Bond Me's incredible. I played uh, Sega Dreamcast every day growing up. Oh, okay, interesting. Okay. And PS3. Yeah, yeah, PS3. All made Asian products. Yeah. You guys don't miss. True. I feel. I, you listen. I want to be. Take us over. Take us over. There we go. I don't want to be American. We welcome the Chinese invasion. I want to be Chinese. I don't. 
I do. <laughs> I would I like do. to be <laughs> Szechuan. <laughs> Asian American Pacific Islander Heritage Month. Alex, Oof. Like, don't you forget it. Yeah. Well, hey, listen, it's not because I was. It's not. I mean, like, if I didn't you care know, too much, it's because you care too much. Obviously, I care. Of great, course. Great month, but also fuck the CCP. <laughs> fuck the CCP. What's wrong with the CCP? What's wrong with China? China? Oh, you did know that one. Oh. Okay. There the, we go. Well, there, yeah, there yeah. we go. Context clues. We don't like that government. They're not so <laughs> they good. They are bad. Yeah, They're it's, naughty. It's what? Bad. Winnie the Pooh But that's go. not so only, wait. There's other Asians besides Chinese people. That's so, so true. We like other. We love North Korea. <laughs> <laughs> we love. Vietnam's Vietnam. a lovely country. Vietnam. I would love to go to Vietnam. Are we sure Indians aren't included in this? Movie? I don't think Indian people consider themselves part of Asian heritage. I don't. Mm. James, can you look that up? What Asian American? Hi- but I think it's Southeast Asia. Because I was with an Indian friend who was like, "This is our heritage month." Really? Yeah. Wow. An Asian. Oh wait, oh, it's APA. Asian, a- they changed it, I guess. Okay, Asian, it's Asian Pacific, Pacific American. American. That's a little but bit. Th- that that's was a little easier. Pacific Island. That's a little easier. Pacific Islander. If it was that, I would have known. No, you wouldn't have. <laughs> you would not have. APA. That's the American Psych- so- so- Psychological Association. I, okay, jo- I, Drag, I did have one more question for you. This was sent to... Okay, actually, yeah. I want to see. Oh, here it goes. Celebration of Asians. Asi- it encompasses all of the Asian continent. Okay. It Hell does yeah, include dude. Indian people. So Fuck Russians. Yeah. Wow. Russians, I guess. I guess. Russians? Russians most of Russians. All right. All right. Um, yeah, I mean, half and the And the Middle East. The Middle East is in Asia. New Zealand? Did they say New Zealand? It has New Zealand. Oh, that's in there's Pacific people down there who's like, yeah, it's my month. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's right. You better fucking respect me. <laughs> I'm white as goddamn snow, but this is my month, bitch. I fuck sheep. We've been through a lot. <laughs> <laughs> We've been through a lot living in fucking paradise. <laughs> There we go. That's <laughs> funny. Why do they include New Zealand? Yeah. Drag, are you on Twitter right now? I'm going to kill you. Uh, No, but I am checking my texts. <laughs> I, I'm oh, going to slaughter dang. him in his sleep. <laughs> he can't not it's check it. What was, the, what was the question? What was the question? There yeah. was no and question. He, he has no idea. You missed Chris's great riff. Yeah. Oh, no. He I, hear, I, hear, I hear that all day. Honestly, Honestly that's, that's, if that, we that cut is... up a clip, can we cut up like... The, the New Zealand stuff and that then it's just good. Drago on his phone during yeah, the whole the thing. Whole, oh, absolutely. We pan That's back perfect. and Drago's just... <laughs> That's perfect. I've, I, I, I've, I've heard it. I've seen it. You've done oh it. I've laughed. God. I've lived. I've laughed. I've loved. not to do anything okay, about it. Okay, Drago. I have another question for you from a guy. Robbie G sent in this question. Friend of the pod. Never met you, but I know he'd be chums, Robbie G. He... Uh, <laughs> I love talking to the camera. It's so fun. <laughs> he uh, Do you think that you would be able to memorize... All of the European capitals, I think he made. I'm going to change it to 10 European capitals, yeah. and I can hit six out of 10 free throws. What could happen first? Pro- Let's try it out. What's the capital of France? Versailles? No. Damn. Oh. I mean, I threw you a but watermelon, that, and you yeah. just had to catch it, I mean, and you, you could. Yeah, I mean, oh, 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 Paris. I mean, yeah, that, yeah. The, but you already got it wrong. Versailles is where all the treaties were signed, just outside the, yeah. the capital. Okay, okay. I thought that was so easy. Okay, Germany. Berlin. Okay. England, United Kingdom. Oh, uh, London, no. Do you, is it? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, let's go London. Okay. I, I hate that. You, those are the three easiest. This no, it's Birmingham. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll see the yeah. Manchester. Come on down. It's fucking Liverpool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, one more. Mm-hmm. This is for, if you do this, I'll consider this a win. Spain. Capital of Spain. Barcelona. Damn it. Uh, no, that's the capital of Catalonia. Capital of Catalonia. Thank you. <laughs> that's true. That's Viva little, la Catalonia. That's controversial. What? Oh, the, ca- wait, the capital is Catalonia? No. no. No, Catalonia is a country. What's the, what's the capital of Spain? It's Madrid. a nation inside of Spain. Ooh. Yeah. Drago. So you could not. I could hit six out of ten free throws, I think. Uh, not before I can. I, feel I mean, like I can memorize the six out of ten is high, but I could do it. Where I do you mem- shoot? I, I feel can, like you're one of those shot put shooters. I can memorize bad. Yeah, I, bad I, form. I can like memorize the capitals the in in an hour. You know, you it, could. it couldn't take. It couldn't take. Oh, you. there we go. Okay, there we go. We each get an hour to prepare. I get an hour to shoot. You get an hour to. I like this memorize no, some be, capitals. No, because do you think he can beat me? I mean, I think it's easier to memorize 10 things. But, than make okay, six. well, we have to raise it to 20. We'd have to raise it to 20. 
Six, I don't, six is hard. It may be like 12 or something, so it's divisible by each other. Or I, I how about I get a... Okay. No, how about you have to study the European capitals, then I pick 10 random ones, and you got to get eight of them right. I think it would be easier if you did six capitals and then six lay six out of ten layups oh i can make six out of ten no. layups aren't, i can make layups ten layups out aren't of ten easy if you don't know what you're doing i'll make yeah. eight out of ten i'll make eight out of ten layups. you would make ten out of ten layups ah uh, no i'd miss one for sure i, I always, miss layups oh, i always choke under pressure <laughs> this yeah. is kind of my thing six i'll uh I yeah I'll, I'll do the free easy. those capitals thing that'd be fun okay there we go I yeah, really, yeah, yeah. I yeah, I don't, I I do want to say keeps... I don't care that if I get these wrong. I really, do, it means absolutely nothing. I don't to think me. Jeff cares if he makes. No, I do see <laughs> oh, you're you wrong, do? Chris. Oh. I do. I, <laughs> I, I truly I, don't care. Because then I can say I'm better at basketball than Drago. Is that, oh. And I can say that for the rest of my life. Is that history? <laughs> no. Yeah. Exactly. Or geography? No, Not better. History. I could beat him one on one. I've challenged him many times, and he refuses. To I just take developed on my runner's knee, which is really fucking my shit? life up. He has a knee problem. You gotta now. get off Google. We gotta limit your Google. <laughs> my knee is <laughs> absolutely torn. I feel like the word symptoms should be child blocked from your Googles. <laughs> He's always has something going on. My, my IT band is absolutely. Did torched. the booster do this? This it, is the booster. I think it might be a side effect. We have to look into it. <laughs> I hate you. Research. Will, I truly research hate, will you. Will <laughs> I Guys, hate you. Guys, this has been a really good episode of the You're podcast. You're just ending it like that? <laughs> uh, he does. We got to do the ad read. Ad read. We are excited to announce a new partnership with Don's Gun Depot, everyone. Don's Gun Depot, has a, and they've agreed they're going to supply weapons to ISIS, oh, and me no. and Drago are going to perform for ISIS like we perform for the USO sometimes, but it's for ISIS. Um, we'll be doing comedy for ISIS and giving them weapons so we can aid the jihad. And that's been the bit. It wasn't as good oh as I thought God. it was going to be. But you know what? We're keeping it in. We're keeping it in. I, I, I don't know. Is that wor- is that what was that worse than not knowing some capitals? Only Th- God knows. Definitely. <laughs> no, it, was, it had its moments, but it didn't go anywhere. You know what? We tried. Oh man. This has been episode twenty-eight of You're an Idiot. Twenty-eight episodes. N-word free. Chris. Thanks Tell people having, where to find drop you. Drop an N-word for us. Thanks for having no, me. No, <laughs> please, no. Yeah, no. It's not funny. Thanks for having me on. And, <laughs> no. and I'll be uh, just, you know, check out my fucking Instagram series, God and Angel. God and Angel. Uh, it's what I'm most proud TikTok, of. TikTok, Instagram, it's amazing. It's so funny. Mm-hmm. We love Chris. Thank you. Love you guys. Ta-ta. You've been an idiot for listening. We love you, Chris. Bye-bye. Dude, doesn't that rip? You're an idiot. No, you're an idiot.